everyone. This is Raymond Lee of Raymond Dental Solutions. When asked if they have ever done the vestibular plasty or a vestibular extension, many general dentists respond that they have never done it. They send those cases to a surgeon because the large amount of the blood involved. In Japan, general dentists also send patients to large hospitals such as university hospitals. However, with the Yoshida CO2 laser called Opilaser Pro 2, it becomes possible for general dentists to perform this surgery whenever it is needed. It's true that when this procedure is performed the conventional way with a scalpel, there is so much bleeding that the dentist cannot estimate the extent of the incision originally planned. However, with the CO2 laser, this can be sufficiently controlled. Let's watch the video. In this case, you need to focus on the cut area. You will notice that in the video, there is no blood around the cut area. The protocol is the same as the conventional procedure. So the method of setting the treatment range is the same. Conventionally, a pack is attached after a procedure. After the procedure with the Opilaser Pro 2, biological glue is released the next day after the procedure. Instead of attaching a pack, you just need to hold the treatment area and pull it outward frequently in the CO2 laser treatment. Usually, it takes more than two weeks for a scalpel surgery to heal, but if you operate with the Opilaser Pro 2, the wound will be healed after a week. In short, the CO2 laser procedure is faster, prevents swelling, and avoids bleeding. The specific protocol of the procedure can be carried out by pulling the buccal vestibular outward to maintain the tension at the surgical site. If a carbonized layer occurs during the procedure, the laser may be irradiated after the carbonized layer is removed. As you can see, compared to a bloody operation such as the vestibular plasty performed with a scalpel, the Opilaser Pro 2 laser procedure provides simplicity and accuracy. So, if that's what makes it possible for a general dentist to take the challenge and perform such procedures, isn't it worth consideration? Thank you so much for watching.